back to the channel. Today, I'm lucky enough to be one of the select few that gets to debut HB Tuner's new standalone core ECU. And this is perfect because this ECU works with Gen 3 and Gen 4 LSs, and I have been needing a standalone ECU for the LS240 for quite some time. The first thing I noticed when unboxing the ECU is it has these magnets in the case, and it just is really aesthetically pleasing. And then you have the cover that says core. On the back of this cover is a QR code and you scan this, it'll tell you all the information you need to know to power up the core ECU, which is awesome because most of the time when I'm wiring up a car, I'm not printing out the wiring diagrams, I'm just looking at them on my phone because I'm doing it either in a parking lot, in my garage, and I don't have access to my computer. So this QR code just really comes in handy. And then you get to the ECU itself, and this thing is all built and manufactured in the United States. And it's also very aesthetically pleasing. And this thing was very well thought through. So this is waterproof case. It comes with these nice isolators. So this can be mounted in the engine bay or inside your car. But since it does have these vibration isolators, you're not gonna have to worry about vibration or water getting into this ECU and damaging it. So it also has weather pack connectors, which is awesome. It's also not much larger than an LS factory ECU. So like the GTOs, you can mount this in the same exact spot in the engine bay and not have to worry about it, which is very, very awesome. So the other thing is this is made in house and in the United States. So quality control on these things is going to be top notch, just like all of other HP tuners product. So you don't have to worry about it being manufactured in China, you have some issue later on down the road, and then you can't get them repaired. And since the core ECU replaces your original ECU, it gives you the ability to better tune the performance of your engine, especially if you're doing an LS swap in a different chassis, or making a buggy, or whatever you're putting an LS in, it just makes a lot more sense than using a factory ECU and then having to hassle with all the factory wiring. You just get this, it's one and done, and then you have all the backing of HP Tuner's current support that they already offer. And they have such a vast database and knowledge of LS tuning. They have a setup wizard with base files to get you up and running with the core ECU. And then you just kind of pick and choose what's on your build so you can get everything kind of dialed in before you take it to your tuner and take it to the dyno. So it's not just really starting off from square one, it's just a really cool feature that they've incorporated into the core ECU, which is gonna help a lot of people out if they're just starting off with their first standalone ECU install and their first time tuning. And the great thing about VCM Live, it's like any of HP Tuner software, it is free to download. So if you wanna check it out before you purchase a core ECU and kind of get familiar with the software, you can do that. It's not something you have to pay. It's not a subscription-based service and it's awesome to use. So if you wanna check it out, it's on their website, really easy to download. Wanna check out HP Tuner's new core ECU and VCM Live and all of its functions, you can head over to hptuners.com slash core ECU and you can see if it's right for your setup and your build. Even though HP Tuners is starting off with Gen 3 and Gen 4 LS engines, they plan on expanding that to many others, which is great. But on top of that, this is a standalone ECU with 16 injector outputs and eight coil outputs, which if you do waste spark, you could do 16 cylinders. So the sky is the limit with tuning and which engine you technically could install the core ECU on. But right now, HP Tuners is only saying that it is for Gen 3 and Gen 4 LS engines, which is already a wide variety of GM engines and I don't think there's going to be any people that are really disappointed. Plus, it also allows the ability to tune the 4L60 and 4L80 transmissions all with one standalone ECU.